Good to see you, Hunter of the Wild. We had a lot of fun shooting all the different species in Hirschfelden with the small bow, as I call it. The Razorback with a draw weight of 60 pounds. And we want to do just the same here in Leighton Lake. Where the animals are just a little bit bigger. I think I'm in Bearwood Forest. There's a lot of bear tracks here. I've been luring bears. And one's actually coming up here. Oh, there it is already. Pretty close. And behind the tree. Luckily, the wind is in my favor. There it is already. It's going to attack. No, it ran away. Many times they will attack you. Gonna be interesting what we hit. The distance was maybe something that 20 meters. And we've got a large blood track, vital hit. Was a bit of a hasty shot. So let's go and uh, find it. Oh, I can see it already. That didn't run far. Might still get a good quick kill bonus here. There's our beer. 76% quick kill bonus. That means it may be, it might have ran for 10 seconds or less. 22 meter shot. I hit the lungs, but it was a hasty shot. Nevertheless, we managed this bear. Still same forest here. I just continue to call and see what's coming. Here's another bear coming. It's a male bear, five medium. Oh, that's a good size bear. And you can tell, wow. It spooked from 85, uh, from 65 meters away, pretty much upwind. No chance to get it closer for a bow shot. But I can hear another one walking. Has to be female. They're a lot less alert. 38 meters. What is this? There's another female. Also at roughly 30 meters. Wow, there's a lot of bears now. Oh, look at this. This went straight down. I had to aim a little bit low. I was guessing 20 meters maybe. Yeah, that was perfect. That was perfect. Just almost too high. I hit the lungs. I hit the spine. And it's a silver score. It's a silver scoring female. That's not too bad from 20 meters. And I'm still getting this bear here. She's still there. Oh, now she's coming fast. What is up with you? Boat is simply not fast enough, but there goes the bear. And here comes the second bear. Not a great shot. Oh wow. Just shot it through the leg. That's really all I hit from 10 meters. And it ran for quite a bit. But anyway, we killed it with a small bow.
Got a medium sized white tail coming up here. Nice looking rack. 30 meters away. Would be nice to get this one here at night. All right, what's he doing? Let's just call it again. All right, there he is. Giving me the broadside. Oh, this looks good. Excellent. Very nice. The buck dropped in its tracks. Must have hit it really well. Went straight down at maybe 30 meters. Let's go see. Large blood spot. Not a huge rack, but nevertheless, I can pick up the arrow. All right, and it's even a silver score. Very nice. 27 meter shot, 120 trophy rating, and everything else at 100%. I hit the spine, I hit the neck. That's why it went straight down. White-tailed deer buck feeding right here ahead of me. 46 meters. And I wonder if I can do a shot from here. Just good enough so that it will certainly not drop in its tracks. But at least die from it sometime rather soon. Aim high a little bit. That looked pretty good. Wow, the arrow quite <laughs> took quite a while to get there. Let's go have a look at this white hill. And here it is already. Quite surprised I marked the place where I shot it. 160 meters is where I shot it. Here's our white tail. Let's see what we hit. Left humerus, left scapula. So it was a bone shot more than any vital hit shot. But still, that went well. 47 meter shot on a mid-size white tail deer buck. Very nice, that went surprisingly well. And it's dead on the spot. About from 20 meters. We seem to have another one. The wind is good, but this buck is worn now. So maybe I just keep calling. Let's see if that comes in as well. I shot this buck from on top of this rock. I can't get back there. There it is already. That's more like 40 meters. And it's also dead on the spot. Wow, that was a good shot. What else do we have? Well, the white tail will have to wait. This was the first buck at about 20 meters. Broken arrow cannot pick this up. 18 meters, it dropped dead right there. And we still have animals coming. Has to be a female though. And we have her down as well. 16 meters. I couldn't spot this one. I don't know what this is. Now nah, the score is only 88. But at 30 meters, I overrated the distance, but still dropped it right on the spot. 
this went pretty well. And I think I can go into the Hunt Club better and pick up some rewards. Yes, it was about hunting Blacktail and Whitetail and I get some extra XP. A black tail deer is in the bush here in the middle of the night. Been calling it in. And there it comes. They walk straight to the light. Not sure if that influences what they see. Like if they couldn't see you like in real life. And it went straight down from about 20 meters. Let's go have a look. Oh, I hit it in the skull from 20 meters. Some coyote lurking around here. One of the few towers I have built. And it's coming from upwind. Let me just measure this distance here when it comes out here. This will be 25 meters. I would have to aim slightly low. So these coyotes come, stand there for a second or two and keep moving forward. Always a little bit moving around. I can hear it. But not see it. Oh, over here. Over here, coyote. That might be 30 meters. Yes, I've hit it on the spot. On the spot, very nice. Oh wow. Very hard to shoot this small animal. But I think the distance was just right. And I can pick up the arrow. Oh, that was a lucky shot. So let's see here, I shot it from, from here. I just, oh, it just turned. It seems the animal just turned and I just barely hit it at the top. But it's a 100% quick kill bonus, 100% integrity bonus. Trophy rating of 37. That is rather small, so this ends up in a bronze. But hey, coyote hits. Very nice. While looking for black tails, I'm getting a warning call from a moose behind me. Had a male, yes. Vital hit. Where did it run? So this was a bit of a surprise. But this might be our moose kill. Warning call from a black bear. Coming up to my moose corpse. The moose is one of the largest animals that I can shoot. And this rather small and weak bow did the job regardless. I hit it straight from the front from rather close. The shot was from 15 meters. It was a lucky situation. Although I do have the caller, I could have called it up to me. Rather small trophy rating. Nevertheless, the bow has done the job. I was able to kill this moose in a rather short time. I'm spotting this really nice moose here. I saw it from a bit further away, so I snuck down. Really good looking moose. And of course, I would like to shoot it with the bow. 
But I have to get a bit closer. The wind is not too bad. It's blowing from the left. So let's just crawl. I just keep calling it. And it's still standing there in the very same spot. I had spotted it before a bit further up the hill and it had trotted away and now it's feeding. That is not ideal. In terms of the antlers, they might be in the way now. I don't think I can shoot the lungs from here when it's feeding. Oh, okay. I hit it. I was just waiting for it to lift the head so that I could uh, shoot at the lungs. I had to aim a little bit low. All right, let's go see. I want to down this big moose with the bow. And it does say vital hit. Very nice. Very nice. Very pleased to find this rather large moose here. Here is my moose. I had shot another one in between with the rifle and uh, now I've tracked it down here. Really nice antlers. Too bad it's got it buried down in the ground. Look at this. Beautiful pattern. So let's see how it's caught. Two hundred eleven is the trophy rating, and that would be certainly a gold trophy if I would have been able to kill it on the spot. And it was a good long shot, perfect long shot with the bow. So that was a pretty lucky shot. I'm quite happy with this one. Roosevelt elk bull trotting in. Ooh, when it's warping about. Wow. I use the perk where you can whistle and the deer will stop. Oh, I got a large plot, but I'm glad to see this. I didn't think it was a good shot. Let's go find it. It seems it warped over the water. No way to, for me to get past this water. I have to find a passage. Wow, this is going to take a while. Oh, I'm glad to see this. <laughs> there it came over the water. And here it is. Roosevelt elk bull. Rather small. It's a three very easy. Which got me a silver score and one over 1,000 in cash, which I'll take. And over 200 in XP. There's a Roosevelt elk. I've been chasing through these bushes. Now I can hear it. There it is. Not sure how well that shot went. Although I see a larger blood splatter Shouldn't be too bad. Vital hit. L underneath the trees up ahead. Let's go see what we hit there. I tend to shoot too high. And it was actually a pretty long shot. Silver score. That went better than I thought. A 235 scoring Roosevelt Elk. And right thereafter, 
I didn't realize I'm shooting a piebald. I didn't realize this just after the elk. I'm thinking that's not worth shooting. Not worth making a video, I mean. And here you go, this is a piebald white tail deer. Yes. Pretty cool. And with this beautiful piebald animal, we conclude this session here in Leighton Lake. We've shot all the species here with the Razorback CB60, the 60 pound bow. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much. Stay in touch.